you mentioned that you go into the ring really relaxed and, and you know, in, in life we just come across a lot of things that, that, uh, that are scary and that, that scare us, that, that we have fear of for doing. Um, I'm assuming that, you know, you're a big guy, you're almost two meters, you weigh over 100 kilos, if I remember correctly, when you're fighting. And the other guy is the same. I mean, we're talking about big, big guys. You walk into that ring, that guy is already there. Is there no, I don't know, anxiety or, or some thoughts that go through your head that you're like, oof, this is going to be one of those days? No, no, because that's also how I stand in my life. That what happens, happens. If he punch me in my jaw and I, he don't, maybe I can get it and I punch him two times back, but it's also possible. Yeah, my brains are uh, gone 10 seconds and I, I, I'm knocked out. Mm. It's possible. If that is possible, also if I'm in, uh, in this house and there will be an earthquake right now, uh, I'm not afraid, oh, the shit will come on my head, oh no. What happens, happens. If it comes on my head, it happens. And then I look, where is the, the blood then? If I, if I uh, survive it or how I can uh, get away. But what happens, happens. You can uh, change. Exactly. That's a, a good way of looking at it, but also, and, and uh, you probably can understand and see it around you, it's something very difficult and not many people have that kind of thought to approach situations just like that. Is there like... Uh, but, but, but to, to uh, interrupt you, if I, am, if I know the ceiling will come down on my head, mm -hmm. and I, I'm, I, I'm waiting, oh, it will come down, down on my head. Oh, it will come down. Then I have no life. I'm stressed. I, I have more stress about getting the thing will fall on my head. Then it really falls on my head and out, oh, boom, and I have a stitch or a bleeding or whatever. If that happens, boom, I mean, I make the best out of it. If it comes on my head, I will try to do the best what's possible. But I will have no stress by, oh, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. What happens, happens. Nice. Well, I, I like that attitude. I like the way that you share it. Thank you for that. Are you still meeting up with your friends now that you're a father? Kids making you stress out. You got no time for yourself to work out, read, or relax. Can you still remember the time you were hanging out with your friends, feeling energetic, happy, and confident? Spending time together and talking about your life and your crazy dreams. You're feeling alone now, don't you? No one to share your challenges with, and you're just running around from one storm into the next. Well, it's time to change this now. Join me and the Brotherhood of Fearless Fathers to speak on a weekly basis with like-minded dads to crush your challenges, face your fears with determination, be held accountable, and regain control of your life. If you want to become the hero your family needs you to be, then go to becomeafearlessfather.com slash brotherhood. Looking forward to seeing you on one of our next calls.